Well, good morning, everyone. This is Sunday, February the 27th. It is a celebration of our Lord's Transfiguration today, uh, just before we head into Lent and Ash Wednesday on March the 2nd. And of course, there are two services, one at 10 a.m. and one in the evening at 7.30 p.m. in person, right here in our own sanctuary. So come on out, receive the imposition of ashes and uh, communion as our first gathering together since we've been shut down for a little while. We are going to begin with the grace. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Almighty God, to you all hearts are open, all desires known and from you no secrets are hidden. Cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love you and worthily magnify your holy name through Christ our Lord. Amen. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. The Collect for the Transfiguration. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Almighty God, on the holy mount, you revealed to chosen witnesses your well-beloved Son, wonderfully transfigured. Mercifully deliver us from the darkness of this world and change us into his likeness from glory unto glory. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. And of course, you know that we are having our, our Zoom vestry today at 12 noon, and so I thought we would have a prayer as part of our opening liturgy today. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Almighty and ever-living God, source of all wisdom and understanding, be present with those who take counsel here in the parish of St. Francis of Assisi, for the renewal and mission of your church. Teach us in all things to seek first your honor and glory. Guide us to perceive what is right and grant us both the courage to pursue it and the grace to accomplish it through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Please join with me in the words of the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever, amen. And now may the peace of God, which passes all understanding, Keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God and of his Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with you this day and always. Amen. <laughs> 